do you think it's safe to stop cold turkey, carvido palibodopa, when you are in the hospital or at home? The short answer is no. So imagine that you are in the hospital, admit it, and you have Parkinson's disease, and you are supposed to be taking carvido palibodopa two tablet three times a day. And for whatever reason, the doctor who is admitting you, the internist or the family practice doctor who is working as a hospitalist, they don't put you on and on your regular carbidopalibodopa, on the medication that you take at home. For whatever reason, even because they forgot to put you on carbidopalibodopa, or they might think that the cause of your confusion is because you are taking carbidopalibodopa. So what happened is when you stop this medication in a patient with Parkinson's disease, and let me, let me be clear about that, in a patient with Parkinson's disease, there is something that you might develop in a few days when you stop this medication drastically cold turkey. And there is something that we call Parkinsonism hyperpyrexia syndrome. Hopefully I'm pronouncing this correctly. Parkinsonism hyperpyrexia syndrome. So those patients are usually very rigid. They become very rigid, stiff. They have fever. The blood pressure goes up and down. And the mortality rate, especially in this population, is from 4 to 20%. So in other words, in summary, if you are admitted to the hospital, make sure that you or your loved one continue with the carbidopalibodopa. Sometimes it's not possible because you are NPO, which means that you cannot take, in, you cannot take anything by mouth or for whatever reason you cannot swallow. In those cases, this is a difficult situation, very rare, but difficult situation. You might need to use a patch uh, for a short period of time until, until you are able to swallow. But remember, be careful with stopping cold turkey, the carvi dopa, livo dopa, because you can die from this. If you like this video, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. See you soon.